Hey everybody, Bandicoot Commando here, and welcome back to Crash Team Rumble. Last time, um, we did the Forest Run game mode, and to a lesser extent, Tokens of Annihilation. Uh, I was able to get to Bob, but I was not able to beat him, sadly. And after that, I wanted to try and do it again or something else, but I was not able to find matches with anything within reasonable time because it was getting late for me that day so I had to call it short there but today we are going to try and take on Bob because well much like before I really won't have much on one week because there's not a lot of events to go by but just a little update on things I've been collecting the silver dragon statues and we're almost there, so there's no limit to these, like picking up seven per day. Like, no. You can pick these up and get all 40 of them in one day if you wanted to. As you can also see, I have gotten the skins for, well, for Spyro, Ripto, and Alora, respectively. So, yeah, Ripto's, here's Spyro, the gem crystal statue. Very, yeah, very, very good looking on him. And then Ripto being the Phantom of the Badlands, not of the Opera, of the Badlands. And then Alora, who's almost at level 14, being Vampire, or should I say Vampiress. Also with um, Alora, I finally got this damn liar. This damn harp liar. So all that's left for her is just party mode to get that banner. And as for that liar, I gave it to Tana. I think it looks better on her. Uh, what else to update? Um, I'm almost there with Ripto. Like, I will be using him as we try to get to Forest Run. So most likely, depending on how long it takes for me to get to Forest Run, I will get this. So there's that. Uh, engine, not much really. Like, still earning some badges for doing Get Lit. I'm going to need friends for this because I do not trust randos to do this. To any of you that watch my videos and who play Rumble and may or may not encounter me online, I mean, I don't know the odds on that, but I've known I've encountered some people, both that are known on Twitter and YouTube from time to time, but... I'll just say this, to any people who who watch my videos and by chance also play Crash Team Rumble, you know my username up there, if you run into me and if I'm leveling up engine trying to get this and I'm doing, you know, dig it, let me get top digger just so that I can get this out of my way and not worry about it. Uh, Cortex, nothing really, just still got to get this and yeah, like... Same with Engine, you know, just let me get these. Don't make me struggle. Coco, nothing new. Just gotta keep going. Uh, nothing new on Spyro. Where are we on that? Okay. Nothing new for Cat. Well, other than, I mean, I mentioned that I got the, uh, the stuff for them. What are those stockings you are wearing? Those socks. They look metallic. But, yeah, just gotta... Man, you're going to take quite a while to work with. Tana, again, nothing. At least the bosses probably won't be too tough. And lastly, Crash. It's, it's tricky because of the fact that I have to deal with Spyro players. The only way I get top runner is if my other three randos do not use either Crash, Coco, or Spyro. Like... Sure, they could use Cortex or Tana or Alora because I could still outspeed them. As for this, this is going to take a miracle at this rate because I did one match where I swear I kept body slamming at least two people, but they did not get squished. And it didn't help that the match was a bit jittery. So had it not been jittery, I would have at least gotten one or two of these. Anyway, enough, enough with that. So... We're just going to do party mode until we reach Bob, and I'm going to take him on for as many times as it takes. So, 
I will see you guys until we encounter him. Forest run. Okay, so last time we used Crash in this. Let's see if Coco might have any better luck with it. Wave one, around the bend. Besides, I am almost close to finishing Coco's, uh, thing. Oh, and for reference sake, I did unlock the, uh, I picked up a silver dragon statue from the previous and got the idol backpack, which I gave to Ripper. Oh, a statue. Oh, I hope I can come back for for it. Okay, good. That's another one. I don't know. I'm not too sure if we're going to beat um, Bob. Oh, of course, one of them makes it. That's another. Okay. Please, oh please. Please let us beat Bob. Okay, that's good. Now let's focus on winning, or let's actually focus on getting there.
Oh, I missed one. Let's hope it... Top Forest Runner! Take that. That's for stealing the crash one when we were doing speed run. Okay, here we go. Can we beat Bob? I have a feeling we're not going to, but only one way to find out. Yeah, we're not going to win. Yeah, we're just... Man, his shots! Well, that was attempt one. Let's hope for better luck for attempt two. Okay, here we go. Next attempt, third attempt against Bob. This time I'm using Tana. I don't know if Tana is a good choice for this or not, but we'll find out. I made it to top runner of all things. Dude, and you just passed by that clock. You are such an idiot. You are such an idiot. Oh, yes, and I also got Ripto's background. I, that Spyro, you are an idiot. You saw me die. Here we go again, guys. The fourth attempt, and this time I'm Cortex. Hold on, I got an idea. Okay, he's just gonna continuously fire. Gotcha. What if we did this somewhat slow? Slow instead. I got an idea on how to defeat Bob. The next time we get there, I'll give it a test. Okay, people, this is gonna sound crazy, but I think, I think Catbat could be a good use against Bob here. My plan and my strategy is I noticed when I was Cortex, I was able to dodge some of Bob's attacks rather easily with my high jumping, so 
that's when it occurred to me that the secret to beating Bob, or at least dodging his attacks very effectively, Have a character that has efficient jumping skills. Stupid genie! Ha ha ha! Oh, baby! Take that, Bob! Oh, wow. Jeez, this took me hours to record. Like, I had to go through so many rounds just to get back here and finally win. And of all the things, it was Catbat that pulled through. I'm proud of you, Catbat. And I'm proud of you, Eric... Erica Ishin, the voice actor of Catbat. <laughs> Alright. Oh, that's enough. I need to get some food in me. Well, alrighty then. Woo, that will do for this session of Crash Team Rumble. Oh, where am I on that? Oh, it's not... Ah! Gotta play party mode a little more to fill that out. But I know who to give that to, so 25 though, and we're right there. I'd say we're in the 30s, anywhere from like 32 to 34, maybe 35 or 36. So, uh, join me next time. Let me check things. Okay, so. I need to check, um, because I need to make sure that I have enough content for the rest of the season, really. Otherwise, I'll have to do another Toys for Bob Lab Shuffle. Alright, let's see. Okay, you two are going up. Yeah, you two are going up next week. And the next week after... Oh, I should have the calendar. I mean, Zap Trap will be next, is what I have in mind. But I need to make absolute sure I'm looking at this right. There we go. Okay, so, um, let's see, Monday, Tuesday, and then, and then I haven't uploaded them yet, but, uh, okay, get out of my way, okay, yes, uh, then, Okay, yeah, uh, next time it will be Zap Trap. Just had to make absolute sure I was reading that right. And uh, who knows, by then, by the next time you see me, I'll probably have more heroes with their badges and such, which I should do a quick check on for you guys. Engine, we're almost there already, we're getting there. I also am making a little progress on getting this. Really, the trick is to be a bastard. Like, literally, just... Oh, shoot, why'd I do that? Oh, no, I didn't want to exit that out. Oh, well. Um, I was going to say, the trick really is to... Um, just focus more on digging. Especially when you get to rounds 2, 3, and 4. Like, just focus more on digging. Don't bother with the pieces. You know, let others 
let others do that. Because you get no badges when you bring the pieces to the center. And Cortex, since I used you a few times, where are you? Okay, so we're a little halfway there with that one, and haven't done a thing with that one. Yes, I gave Coco... Oh, it's full of gems. I thought it... I wasn't sure if it was full of ice, but... Gems, okay. Where are we, Coco? Okay, so we just need to work on it a little more, and then it'll be there. And then... Cat Bat, where are you on stars? Yeah, well... It'll take a while to get through you. But at least, yeah, one step closer. And then you, Tana. Okay. Just checking everything. I got a lot of work to do. Alrighty, so yeah, like I said, join me next time as we do the Zap Trap. That is it, and I will see you guys next time.